Hello! Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Misa and I am crazy about helping you enhance your foundation routine and complexion products and we cover all of that here. So if you haven't already, be sure and subscribe. I upload videos every Monday and Friday. Let's go ahead and get into this video. It's like Christmas before Christmas and it's the one of the best times of the year. Sephora is doing their biannual, they're doing their event where they're going to have a sale depending on what tier level you're on. If you're Rouge or VIB or Insider, Rouge gets 20% off, VIB gets 15% off, and Insider gets 10% off. Now if you're confused, if you're even part of this, you can just go sign up for Sephora on Sephora. You don't it doesn't take, you know, you're not telling them any of your credit card information. You're just signing up for a rewards account and bam, you're insider. So you're at least getting 10% off, which let me tell you, this is time to take advantage because Sephora, do they ever do sales? Um, no. Do any of these amazing products go on sale? Rarely. And so now is the time if you're thinking about getting gifts for a makeup lover or heck right now in this video, I'm going to be talking about gifts for yourself, all about complexion. We're talking setting powders, foundations, things that are going to help you get that flawless look. Products I have purchased, products I have tried, products I would purchase again. Okay, now I'm just getting way too excited. So let's just start with one of my absolute favorites. Go to the Smashbox Photo Finish primer oil. Now this retails for $40. And I know what you're thinking, why do I need to pay $40 for a primer oil? I'm not going to have to pay full price because of the sale going on. But this has been a game changer for me. It's not irritating. It doesn't clog my pores, but it has been the most moisturizing product primer wise that I have purchased ever. What I love about it is it's super lightweight. It absorbs really fast and it just gives you this beautiful natural glow but it's not heavy. And right before you put on your foundation, I mean, it just makes your foundation go on super beautifully without affecting the finish. I also love the packaging of this. It's in a glass bottle. This is just going to last you so long. You can use this morning or night. I'm telling you, it's a game changer. It is a game changer. The next product that I have been head over heels for is the Super Goop Unseen Sunscreen. This is SPF 40. Now what's so amazing about this, it's insane, is it's a clean product. So it's a non-irritating, there's no synthetic fragrances in this and I think sometimes we forget during the winter that we still need SPF so this has been working great for me I put it over the oil that I have and it doesn't affect anything but it's clear see I just put that on it goes on completely clear there's no white cast it's blurring and so it just is the perfect primer especially this combo on top of this is amazing and on top of that the price of this is what I think it's only like $34 right it's $34 just knew it on the top of my head and this has been just game changing for me. And this is probably going to be my go-to sunscreen day in and day out. I've just been so impressed with this. It doesn't clog pores. I've had a lot of issues with other face sunscreens that eventually I would just start breaking out. Now, before we get into some of the other makeup products, there is a product that I recently purchased and it had, honestly, it's been eye-opening and phenomenal. And it's the ordinary niacinamide 10% treatment with zinc. What is niacinamide? Now niacinamide, it helps replenish dull looking skin. It helps balance sebum production. For me, I have dry skin. Do you have dry skin? Let me know in the comments down below. But I have dry skin, but I also produce too much sebum and so I get blackheads, I get all kinds of breakout. Over the summer, I just got so bad and it was so frustrating because it didn't matter what I do, I would just keep getting all these tiny bumps that eventually would turn into these bigger bumps. It was because of blackheads. And so when I, I got this about two weeks ago and I've already noticed a huge difference. I just put this on at night right before I go to sleep over my problem areas. It has helped immensely, immensely. This is definitely a tr an additional treatment to your skincare routine. It's not a serum, but I have woken up with just softer skin. I have woken up with actual results. Last night I was starting to get a really bad blackhead and it was all the way underneath. I put some of this on last night and this morning it's already tamed down. So it's been really nice to have this. And on top of that, this is so affordable. I think it's like $6. And so you might as well snag that extra percentage off and add it to your makeup collection, not makeup collection, skincare collection. And on top of that, always remember with this to use something really hydrating. I have a friend that's a master esthetician and she said to use a hyaluronic acid serum, something really hydrating with this because this can dry out your skin. Now we're going to be talking about a brand I'm quite passionate about, passionate about 
but I don't like bringing it up all the time because of the price. And that would be Hourglass Cosmetics. Guys, there's a reason why now is the time to get these while they're on sale because they are pricey. My first and foremost recommendation is going to be the Hourglass Ambient Lighting. This one's called the Lighting Face Palette in Sculpture. I have the Ghost Edit which is their last year's edition. This is great if you haven't tried the brand before. And the reason why is because it comes with the ambient lighting powder, which is this light dusting of powder. It's like a setting powder. And it's amazing for dry skin and it gives you this inner glow. I'm using it today. The lightest layer that sets your foundation but just gives you luminosity and it's the perfect. It's just an amazing product. I've gone through so many different, um, this one is completely, I've hit pan, I'm done with it. And I just, I, I'm obsessed. And so it comes with two ambient lighting powders. And then it comes with a strobe light, which is their highlight. And then it comes with a bronzer, which their bronzers are just as beautiful. It just gives that beautiful summer glow from within. Nothing too strong. It's not matte, but it's not shiny. It's the perfect luminosity. And then two blushes, which are absolutely gorgeous. Not this exact one, but the gold one, which is $80. But if you have your percentage off, I mean, it's definitely the time to get it. Their bronzer, this is their Radiant Bronze, is amazing. This has just been my go-to over the summer. But these are expensive. If you buy every one singly, these are about $50 on their own each. I know, it's expensive. I don't have a problem paying the price or something that I love and enjoy and actually hit pan and use up. So now would be the time to kind of, you know, splurge on that, see what you think, if it works for you. And what's also nice about Sephora, Guys, they take back makeup if you don't like it. If you buy it, you try it out for a couple weeks, take it back if you don't like it. But I know you won't need to take back these because they're amazing. Now, another thing I love about these, this brand is the loose setting powder. So I use a loose setting powder to either bake or to set my concealer. This is what I used to set my concealer. This is my second one I've purchased. It does last pretty much the whole year. And this is perfect for dry skin, very lightweight. Just a great way to spoil yourself, but also to give yourself that flawless, but not heavy looking complexion. I believe I just talked about Hourglass for two minutes, dang. Okay, the next product is another bronzer that I'm absolutely obsessed with, and this is the Fenty Beauty, and this is the shade Island Ting. This bronzer is, oh, it's so good. It's a matte formula, but it's creamy, zero fallout, buildable, never too heavy, never any kind of weird cast going on. I'm actually not wearing this one today, I'm wearing my hourglass, but it's gorgeous. It's one of my favorites. This is actually my second one of these as well. I went through one last year. This is normally $30, so like I said, a great time to get it while you get a discount. So many different shades, so many different undertones. Packaging, once again, is flawless, but it's just one of those standout bronzers that you can contour your nose, you can put it in your crease. There's just so many different uses and it would be a phenomenal product in your collection. I do have my fair share of drugstore bronzers that I love, that I enjoy. I do have a video about all of my favorite bronzers at different price points and I'll just have it in my description box down below. There is something about a high-end bronzer and especially these two that just blow everything out of the water. All right, the next item I recommend for you is this blush. This is the Patrick Ta blush. This is in monochrome. Oh, so this is a monochrome moment in She Sincere. First and foremost about this formula, it's not highly pigmented. It's definitely pressed harder and this is perfect if you're someone that wants the most sheer melted blush look. Something that just melts into your skin. I'm wearing it today. I'm wearing it now without being like, bam, she's wearing blush. It just is the perfect color enhancer. It ties together your bronzer, your highlight, and it's stunning. And I've been using this constantly for the last six months and I haven't even hit pan. My recommendation with this is to use a synthetic brush to apply. Let me grab you the one I've been using with it. Okay, I'll have the best blush brushes linked down below too. And this is the Morphe Times Jaclyn Hill JH04. But anything like this, that synthetic hair is going to be perfect for this kind of blush because it's pressed harder, use this, just go like this, blend out and it's perfect. Not a lot of fallout like I said, but if you go in with a finer goat haired brush, you're not gonna have any payoff. It's buildable, so you can just keep building it up. If you're looking for something more pigmented, you're gonna wanna go in with a goat haired brush and you're not gonna wanna get this blush, but this one is perfect for especially beginners, someone that just wants a very natural look. Now, I'm a foundation channel, so 
You bet I'm gonna be buying a lot of foundations for this Sephora sale. I consider this my job now that I'm monetized on YouTube, so maybe it'll be a tax write-off, maybe it'll even out, I don't know, we'll see. I haven't expanded too much on the foundations, but I do have a couple recommendations. And this is the Too Faced Born This Way Matte 24 Hour Foundation. If you're looking for something lightweight, something that doesn't have anything alarming in it, as far as ingredients, I have a whole video. It's called the Truth Series. You can find it. I'll have it linked down below where I wear, where I do a wear test on this. Go over all the ingredients just to see if there's anything sensitizing. You know, if you're paying forty dollars for a foundation, you want it to be like the top notch ingredients. And I was really impressed with this formula. This is definitely matte. It's definitely great if you have oily skin, combination skin. If you are someone like me who has dry skin, I have so many tips below. I have so many tips in another video about how to wear matte foundation if you have dry skin. Now, if you're looking for something a little more um, dewy, let me grab it. Is the Tarte Babasu Found Sealer. This is very hydrating. The ingredients in it are great. There's nothing to be concerned about but it doesn't last super long, which is great if you are someone who likes something really hydrating, really dewy, you have that luminosity. I usually don't even have to use a setting spray with this because you're seeing the dewiness come forth and it's beautiful. Last but not least, if you're looking for a good primer, something that's soothing, really grips your foundation on your skin, I will recommend the Milk Hydro Grip Primer from Milk Makeup. This is so soothing. I really like to use this with I put it on with my hands, of course, and then I go in with a foundation that's used with a sponge, and it just kind of pats, I pat it on, and this really does grip your makeup on, and it's beautiful. I mean, this is stunning, right? I mean, I've got, okay, last but not least <laughs> of complexion products, this is the Watermelon Glow Ultra Fine Mist. I love this mister. Oh, it's, and the scent. I absolutely love this. This is so refreshing. I use it all the time and Glow Recipe is an amazing brand. Their skincare line, I've used their mask before. It, they have these little sets so it can come with this, it can come with their watermelon sleeping mask, it can come with like an eye product. So I would definitely stock up on that as well if you're just wanting interested in the spray. It's $28, but it's perfect if you have dry skin. It doesn't extend the length of your makeup, but it just refreshes, revitalizes. Mm. And sometimes at night right before I go to sleep if I just really want that extra burst of moisture after doing my skincare routine I'll go in with this. All right, you guys those are my complexion recommendations for the Sephora sale Please let me know in the comments down below what you get remember the sale starts this Friday if you are rouge and then the dates I'll have them all down below for consecutively, but you're definitely going to be able to shop the sale enjoy it definitely Think about spoiling yourself and your complexion and also stocking up on some gifts for family and friends. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching and have a great day. Bye. I'm all alone, cause you never show. You say you've 